Welcome to Alan Video Tutorials. Today you will learn how to build a voice assistant and integrate it directly into your React Native app to later run it on the iOS and Android platforms. With the in-app voice assistant in place, your users will be able to ask questions about your app and perform any tasks using their voice. The best of breed artificial intelligence and machine learning technologies and services needed for the voice assistant will be provided by the Alan platform. And the only thing you will need to start off is your app. So let's get some nice app that we will be using throughout this series. We'll go to Instamobile.io and download one of their free templates. We will need to specify an email address, hit download freebie, and then get the app itself using a link sent to the email address we have provided. Opening it up. As we can see, the app is created with the Expo Toolkit, so we'll install all the dependencies and start the app with Expo. With the developer tools launched, let's run our app on Android emulator to check it out. Looks good. But before we get to building a voice assistant, we need to make another adjustment to the app. As mentioned before, the app is created with the Expo Toolkit. It is fast and powerful and doesn't require you to deal with the iOS and Android layers. But to be able to customize our app and add a voice assistant, we need to have native projects that can be opened in Android Studio and Xcode. So let's convert our app with the Expo Eject command. We have the app, now let's create a voice assistant for it. Head on to studio.alan.app and sign up. Then hit Create Voice Assistant. We'll name it Food App Voice Assistant and click Create. In the code editor, there's a voice script or the dialogue for our future assistant. It has only one generic intent Hello World. We can check how it works using the debugging chat on the right. Hello world! Hi there! Now that we have the app and we have the voice assistant, let's integrate them. We'll click Integrations at the top of the code editor. Select the platform, iOS or Android since our app can run on both and choose React Native. Here we can see a list of steps needed to bring the voice assistant to the app. The first two steps are related to the environment setup. Install the React Native command line interface and make sure you have CocoaPods installed to be able to build the app for the native iOS platform. We already have this done, so we'll jump to the third one. With this command, we'll add the Allen plugin to our app, which is needed to voice enable it. Navigating to the project folder and running this command in the console. The plugin is installed, let's add the voice assistant button. Once we click this button, we'll be able to give voice commands to the voice assistant in the app. Let's click copy to the right of the next block and open the file for our app navigation component. First, we will paste the copied import statement at the top and get back to Alan Studio for the next integration step. Next, we need to add the button itself. And we'll put it to the navigation container. The key you can see here uniquely identifies your voice project running the cloud. That's practically it. However, to successfully run our app, we need to make some more adjustments for the native platforms. For Android, make sure the minimum SDK version is set to 21 or higher. Depending on your environment, you may need to define packaging options in the build Gradle file. You can get them in the troubleshooting section in our docs. For iOS, go to the iOS folder, open the port file and make sure the iOS platform version is set to 11. 
then run pod install to install dependencies. And since our app requires access to the device microphone, you need to explicitly explain why you need this access. So open the Xcode project, go to the info tab, add the privacy microphone usage description key and provide any message to be displayed to the user once your app is launched. Done. Let's run the app and talk to it. Hello world. Hi there. After you have embedded the voice assistant to your app, you can simply add new intents to the voice script and they will be immediately available to be used. Check it out. What is it? This is a voice enabled recipe app. Now build a voice assistant of your own with Alan AI and subscribe to our channel. A tutorial on completing tasks in the app with voice is coming next.